Next, we will consider three muscles that are found in the anterior compartment of the leg. This is the tibialis anterior muscle. It is right next to the tibia. It has an origin on the lateral surface of the tibia and inserts onto the medial cuneiform and the base of metatarsal one. The tibialis anterior inverts the foot and dorsiflexes the foot at the ankle joint. The extensor digitorum longus muscle has an origin on the proximal half of the fibula and the lateral tibial condyle. And it inserts by way of these four tendons onto the bases of the middle and distal phalanges of the four lateral toes. The extensor digitorum longus extends the four lateral toes and dorsiflexes the foot. The extensor hallucis longus is not easily seen on this model. In order to see it, you have to remove the extensor digitorum longus. And then if you look underneath the extensor digitorum longus, this muscle which is labeled 20 on this model is the extensor hallucis longus. The, so let's put this muscle back and talk about it. The extensor hallucis longus has an origin on the medial surface of the fibula and inserts on the base of the distal phalanx of the great toe. So if we zoom in, we can see where the tendon comes out right over here. and follow it to its insertion on the big toe, the great toe. The action of this muscle is extension of the great toe and dorsiflexion of the foot.